Okay, we start recording. Yes, we have. Hello, everybody. My name is a regular gamer. Alex, welcome back once again to Sea of Solitude. So, last episode, we were finally able to resolve the issues of the mom and the dad, and then finally learning that just because letting go does not mean you don't love each other anymore. But now we're on to uh, what's his name? Jack. Kay's uh, boyfriend. See if we can help him in the issues evolving Kay and, well, him. Oh, I forgot about these guys. We saw the yellow girl again. She suddenly just turned into these creatures. I think we're almost there. Come on, you got this. Made it. Hopefully I can do it in time. Yes, I did it. Whew, okay. Jack? Bright. I forgot how bright this game is. Times. He's acting so weird. It's starting to scare me. Oh, sorry. Had to move the mouse. I got something in my eye. Great. Always perfect timing. Oh, Glowy. Come on, let's get you out of corruption, man. No, Glowy. Come on, Glowy. Why have you been ignoring me? Relax. You're stressing me out. Fourteen days. Fourteen days since I heard from you. I didn't know if you were hurt or, or dead. Did you not think about how I would feel, even for a second? No, Kay. I wasn't thinking about your feelings while I was in the deepest, darkest pit imaginable. I'm sorry that not everything is about you. Deepest, darkest... what? You're scaring me, Jack. Please, Kay. Just... leave me alone. I'll only cause you pain. No! I love you! You're not alone! I'm here for you. I don't want that! Not anymore! Leave me alone! It's blurry, but I think I remember that. It was recent. Maybe just a month ago. <clears throat> oh, forgot about the seagulls. Jeez, this one's always hard, trying to like do the whole circling thing. Well, if I can make this. Okay. And once again, I do apologize I don't do the most amount of commentary for this kind of game. It's because this narrative is so... It's one that's hard to talk over. Because with a narrative like this, the only thing you really can do is just listen to it. So it's hard to really do too much commentary, except for maybe during parts like these. But a good part of this game seems to be narrative or meaning driven. And I can't like really commentate over those. Come on, Kay. Come on, Kay. Meet it. Come on. It's right here, it's right here, it's right here. Boom, made it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Before we show up. Yes. Whew. Did it. Okay. Let's hear more about weapon between King and Jack. Because those things always like to talk while we're doing this. Leave me mm -hmm. alone. Leave me alone. Jack? There are statues of, statues of Kay. Yep. Leave me alone! Oh no. He's being attacked by those things. 
It's interesting, Maybe it's like those things you. represent well you, okay? I know how to destroy them. I've done it before. Boom, okay. Got that one. Talk to me. I just don't like being around people anymore. I can't stand it. What? But people love you. Your students, your friends. I do. Okay. It's all fake. I'm fake. I think that's where the whole wolf in sheep's clothing kind of thing is coming from. No, I messed up. I'm not gonna be able to make it, but okay. I'll try at least. I don't think I'm gonna make it, or I'm gonna make it. I made it. All I do is hurt people. You never hurt me. That's not true. Remember all the times I wasn't there for you. But you always had a good reason. No. I, I just couldn't bring myself to go outside, or you get out of bed. I felt like that way many times. I know others who also felt like that. And this game is deep meanings. This is still probably my most favorite games with its whole deep meanings. Because some of the stuff they're saying and whatnot are very relatable. That's okay. That's not the point. Without me, you would be happy. I would be alone. Without you, I would be lost. That's not true! I lie in bed every day, asking myself, why should I even bother getting up? Then I go to work, it seems fine, and then suddenly, I hate everything that's okay that happens to everyone even me this thing it's not about you you're right it's not about k it's about you jack what if i'm really really not okay it's okay then let me help to you. not be okay what man if... You can't help me. Okay, listen to me. I need to figure this out on my own. Okay, I understand. Some people do need to I figure out stuff like this on their own. In my life. You need to let me go. Sometimes that is the thing you need to do. Man, I swear, this, this game tugs on so many heartstrings. Whether or not you actually relate to them or not, no matter what, it, it hits the feels. It really does. That's probably one of the most biggest things I absolutely love about this game. Hey, Jack. I need to work on myself now without leaning on someone else. We both do. Do you understand? Okay. No. No. I can figure this out! Don't leave me alone! Face it! Let go of me! Let go of us! Okay? Out of tear. Take care of yourself. She meant locked breakdown. Come on, Kay. Oh, great, it's a fish monster. Why is she back? <sighs> <clears throat> Sorry. Throat's still not the best. Except now the ones where we're the ones with corruption surrounding us. 
He's gone. Chapter 11, Isolation. We just need to move on too. I'm stuck. Here in the dark. You can get unstuck. I'm still with you. All this monster again. How nice. I was just thinking about you. Maybe you should eat me. Then everyone would be happy. It's a buoy. Wait, who did that? Was that us who did that or someone else? Oh, what is rising? Are you still with me, monster? I will always be by your side, okay? Maybe we really do deserve each other. I feel so heavy. It's like I'm stuck to the ground. I need help. Girl? Are you here? Maybe. I'm so glad to see you. Really? Are you sure? I was so awful to you. I wasn't myself. It's fine. We all have bad days like that. Even me. Even me too. <laughs> just a bad day. It's okay. We're together again. That means something, doesn't it? You're right! I was and always will be by your side, Kay. I promise. I know. Thank From you. From now on, we can do this together. Okay. But how? We just have to share the burden. It will make you feel lighter. I You're promise. not wrong but that. Sometimes sharing oh. a burden with others. Okay. Make it feel less heavy. I feel lighter already. Ah, the monster's chasing me now. We can use these to distract her. Okay. Send those things to me. I can distract her. That's actually. <laughs> I will say that's actually really smart, but... <coughs> Jeez, the weather's been so bad lately, my allergies... I think I'm starting to get cold as well. And that's never fun. Made it. Okay, one more time. Are you coming with me? Yay. Thank you. Oh, you're the one who probably hit the other buoy. And woes the water level up more and more. I'm glad you're here. I don't feel so alone anymore. Even if one of them is trying to eat me. Oh, it's her, the other monster, except without the shell. You? Hey, you made it. I'm happy you're here, too. I... I wanted to tell you, I'm so, so sorry. What? Why? I hurt you when I should have listened to you. No, Kay. You did the right thing. What? What do you mean? <laughs> Follow me. Okay. Sorry, wonder these. I'm starting to wonder if this monster is actually evil or not. I was trying to tell us to stop trying to go after Jack, because Jack needed to figure out his own things for himself. Do you trust me now? Of course. <laughs> the experience with Jack was painful, but it was important. You needed to learn. Yeah. It almost destroyed me. I'm all alone now. No, you're Are not. You? Do you feel lonely? You're not alone. No matter what, Kay, you're not alone. No matter what, you're not alone. Kay, you are not alone. You will never be if. What? What do you mean? Kay, be patient, please. 
Oh, I'm trying. Yeah, it can be hard being patient. Being, being patient, I mean. Hell, I'm not even the most patient person myself. I will admit that. But sometimes you need to be. We are almost there. Mm hmm. Made it. Oh, I say again, this is one of my most favorite games. I've never played a game with this much deep meaning in its narrative storytelling, and once I hit so close to home, and so much on my heartstrings. I have played emotional games like Romance E Adventure, other ones, but nothing quite like this. This game is a special game. One that I definitely recommend others to play. No, no, I forgot to. Oh. That was entirely my fault. I'm gonna go ahead and do that so I can actually be able to move. Thank you, girl. Like how we just call you girl, even though we're, we're all, we all pretty basically know that you're basically a representation of K. Something like that. Hey. Not wrong about that. No! For the first time, I don't feel lonely. I can't lose you. It's not about loss. It's about change. I have to trust him. I have to trust. over there. Looks like we got rid of the monster by not letting go, but changing. Hey, wait for me. Where are we going now? It's actually quite beautiful up here. Probably most of my green we've seen in this game. Oh, what's that? Did you find out who can truly help you? Hey, you're so small now. <laughs> you got your shell back. Yes. You're so tiny. I know now. Mm hmm. And even the little fish monster is all small now, too. Oh, that's actually kind of adorable. Yeah, come join in. Fuck it. Sometimes you need a hug. Here's a kind of air hug to everyone who's watching. Air hug. Sometimes you just need a hug.
Hello, Kay. It's good to finally see you. Achievement unlocked. You unlocked Resolve. Good job, Kay. Made it. Proud of you. Proud of you, Kay. <laughs> now we just need to put the other family members on the boat. Yep. With Sunny and the mom and dad. And of course, Jack still needs to figure out his things on his own. Because sometimes that's what people need to do. But now, we finally got our resolve. We can finally get onto the boat. Or not, it's not letting me. Great. That's my nose itches. First time for my allergies to be acting up. Where is everyone? Oh, I'm going the wrong way, apparently. At least I might get to their side for over here. Okay, looks like I was going the right way, because nothing that way. <laughs> Guess we need to find them. Where are they? Oh, that's just some rocks. <laughs> Gotta go completely around. No way I can get back up. Oh, that's also just another rock. Oh, this is the credits! Oh, I didn't even realize this around here. The shoreline, it's the credits. I always love when video games let you actually play along with the credits. Like this one game, except it was a comedic game that I played a while back that did this. It was called Octodad. This game. Oh, you were the lead Ant-Man and the voice of K? Nice job, Miriam. Nice job. To everyone whose names is in this credits you guys made. You guys didn't make a video game. You made a experience. One that I hope many others get to experience as well. If you've not played this game, I recommend playing it over 100%. Because this game is more than just a game. It is a full-on experience and one I'll probably never, never forget. Most emotional, most deepest meaning. This game hit heartstrings that were close to home for me and more. What's this? What are these? Like a little, oh, little sand thingy. Oh, it's our little boat. Our boat. Oh, a good old trusty boat. We have seen you since we land on the ice. Like a beach resort island. Which means all that's left is to go up here. Chapter 12, feeling good. Like I should. What? Are you ready? Are you ready? That is such an interesting last words for a game. Are you ready? Are ready to move on? Let go? Change? That one phrase could mean so much. I'll say again, this is probably one of my favorite games I've played on this channel. It is emotional, it is deep meaning, and it's so many harsh things that are close to home. For me and probably for so many other people, this game is not just a game, it is a experience. And one I recommend many others to play it. Even if you watch me play it, I recommend you playing it yourself. Because I will say again, this is more than anything. This is more than any game I've ever played. Probably in my life. I played I played deep meaning games. I have. Even on this channel, like What Remains Eat Event was very much about family and letting go and such. But nothing quite like this. Of all the games I've played in my life, I think this one probably one of my most memorable games I will remember from the deepest of my heart. This 
was more than just a game. I'll say again. This was an experience. One that almost made had to grab the tissue box, for God's sakes. Whew. I mean, I was feeling waterworks, man. <sighs> oh. Damn. I don't even, I can't even think any games that would probably even top this. This was truly amazing. <clears throat> Ugh. Ugh. Hope this cold goes away soon. Ugh. <laughs> EA partners. <laughs> yeah, I forgot this was part of the whole EA Access thing. I haven't played too many games from the whole EA Access thing, but this is definitely number one. This was a game. This was an experience. One I'll probably never forget. I'm glad to have shared this kind of experience with you guys. It's one of the biggest reasons why I do YouTube. That and to probably put smiles on people's faces. Like YouTube did for me back when I was little. Back when... Back when life itself a show was becoming, well, life, I guess. <laughs> Oh, whoa, what's happening? Oh, is this Jack? Good, Jack still needs to figure out his life. Yep, I'm guessing this is probably Jack. Hey, Jack. We finished Kay's journey and helped her. Now it's time for us to help Jack. Is that it? Yep, that was it. I'll say again, this is probably one of the best games I've played on this channel, and it was more than just a game, it was an experience, and one I hope many guys play, because this game hit so many heartstrings once they are very close to home, where for now we actually went through stuff similar to it or seen others go through similar things. This was an experience, and one I definitely recommend you guys also try out for yourselves. But without further ado, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And if you guys have any gaming recommendations at all, do leave it in the comments down below. But until then, I'll see you guys next video. Stay awesome and know this. You're never alone. Never. <laughs>